All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakodash, the ones that tie ill, the apostles of great meals, on that do it well, and salutations and bless you, I can just push this word with true sincerity and charity. All right, today I just want to get into this quick lesson. I'm going to title it, All You Adulterous Women Will Perish. All right, because, hey, man, uh, um, who is this? Uh, Jada, Jada Smith, you know, hey, she, she um, put this spirit out here, man. This adulterous spirit, all right, on these uh, women, man. All right, with uh saying that uh she's in an entanglement, all right, with uh August Al 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 Alstina or whatever, man. But hey, this this really ain't even about them, man. All right, but hey, I I'm I'm gonna speak on it because she she's putting that spirit back back out here even more, man. All right, and all, all these women they still had that adulterous spirit on them, they still got that adulterous uh mindset, man. All right, because of Babylon the Great. All right, they give our women uh, um, um, the liberty to gather bride, man. All right, and do whatever the fuck they want to do. So, hey, they're, they're, uh, of course they're going to commit adultery, man. Of course they're going to have those uh, adulterous acts inside of their man, man. All right, all they got to do is lie and tell their husband, hey, I'm, I'm going to the grocery store. All right, and then go uh, go get rotted out, man, you know. But, hey, with any further ado, I'm going to jump to the scriptures. So, this is Exodus 20 and 14. It says, thou shalt not commit adultery. All right, so, hey, man, that's straight off bat, man. All right, this is in the law. All right, you cannot commit adultery, man. All right, and hey, these people, they they like to claim that hey, we're uh, they're the Christians, all right, and all this shit, man. All right, but hey, these Christians don't follow anything that's inside the Bible, man. All right, they'll tell you that hey, no, no, it, well, it, it it's okay to be in a in, in an entanglement, <laughs> you know, it, it's okay to go and uh deal with another man, all right, and come back to your husband, man. All right, that's fucking folly, man. That's wickedness, man. All right, Yahweh Shem Al Shai is gonna deal with you accordingly, man. You know, but. Hey, since I said that word, let me go into it. Now, this is what the word entanglement means. It says, the action or fact of entangling or being entangled. All right? Now, uh, it says a, a complicated or compromising relationship or situation. Okay? So, here are some uh, sem synonyms for, for the word. Uh, let me see. Cause one of them had adultery on the. Now nah, I don't want to pop up, man. <laughs> That's Esau for you. But hey, what a hey, what? Uh, uh, when I looked this up a couple of days ago, man. All right, the the synonyms was uh for for one of them was adultery, man. All right, but hey, it says a complicated or compromising relationship or situation. All right, which is adultery, man. Okay, so let me get. Get Leviticus, all right. Cause hey, this this is what's supposed to happen, all right. When when you're when you're, when you're in an entanglement or when you're uh committing adultery, man, for a man or a woman, man, all right. But hey, for the most part, I'm gonna speak on you women today. So this is Leviticus 20 and 10 it says, and the man that committed adultery with another with another man's wife, and he that and he that committed adultery with his neighbor's wife, uh, the adultery and the adulteress, all right, shall surely be put to death. All right, so hey man, if you're uh, uh going to have sex with another man, all right, or if a or if, uh, man is going to go going to go have sex with another man's woman, man, all right, you are committing adultery, man. You deserve death, man. All right, point blank, period. Okay, because hey, you're breaking the law, such commandments. So Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. All right, and it tells you in Romans uh six and twenty three that the way that the wages of uh, um, uh sin is death, man. All right, so hey, that that payment is gonna is gonna be uh with your life, man. All right, because hey, you just broke a bond between a man and a woman, man. All right, you just broke their uh their spiritual bond, man. So now you had to pay with that uh pay for that with your life, man. Okay, so and hey, man, hey, people people don't don't want to uh um um come to the realization is that that that's what it is, man. But hey, it doesn't matter what you think. All right, because hey, Yahweh Bashmi Al is absolute, man. His word is absolute, man. All right. So this is uh Sirach twenty six and verse eleven it says, "Watch over a impudent uh eye." And marvel not if she trespasses against thee. So, hey man, hey, if your if your woman uh, trespasses against you, man, hey, don't 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 be surprised about that, man. All right, because that's in these women's spirits, man. All right, they want to go out here, they want to uh, step out on you, man. All right, these women want to go and fuck another nigga, man. All right, to be quite frank, man. All right, that's what they want to do, man. And it says she she will open her mouth, uh, she will open her mouth as a thirsty traveler when he have found a fountain. All right, and hey man, hey that that's meaning that she's gonna open up her mouth to every rod, all right, and drink of every water near her, all right, and uh by by every hedge 
Will she sit down and open her quiver against every arrow? Meaning she's going to be opening up her legs to every uh, every ride, man. All right. And hey, that's the spirit of these women, man. All right. So, hey, don't don't be surprised when your woman goes and uh, steps out on you, man. All right. Hey, hey, man, the, the best thing to do is focus on yourself, man. All right. If anything, man. All right. So, hey, you won't you, you won't be uh, 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 um, so fucked up. All right. If your woman if your woman was to do that, man. All right. Which hey, is it's, it's a very sad and unfortunate thing, man. But hey, this is what we have to deal with. In this captivity, man. All right, adulterous women, man. Whores, man. All right, cause hey, that's all we got, man. Is fucking uh, uh 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 sluts and bitches, man. Shame, shameless women, man. All right, which I believe. Yep, this is uh Sirach twenty six and verse twenty five says a shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that is shame faced it will fear Yahweh. All right, and, hey man, none of these women are shame faced, man. For the most part, man. All right, hey, hey if you if if you if you find a, a good woman, man. All right, it's either that she's she's gonna be extremely old, all right, or shit, they probably already in the spirit world already, man. All right, because hey, these women, these women down here, hey man, is you're it's gonna be very rare for you to find one that's that's uh shame faced, man. All right, one that's willing to deal with you and willing to uh dwell with you, man. All right, without causing you any problems like committing adultery, man. You know, sneaking behind your back, man, texting other men, man. All right, hey man, hey, this is a very wicked and, and adulterous generation, man. You know, hey, let me saying that. Let me grab this. Because, hey, man, hey, man. This is uh, Hosea, shot the four and verse one. It says, hear, oh, hear the word of Yahweh. Um, Salakia. Hosea four and one. It says, hear the word of Yahweh, ye children of Israel. For Yahweh hath a controversy with the inhabitant, with the inhabitants of the land, because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of Yahweh in the land. All right, it's nothing but wickedness. In, uh, what you so called Negro, Spanish, and Native Americans dwell, man. All right, because you are of your father, the devil. All right, you want to uh go after your flesh, man. All right, so hey, man, hey, you 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 don't you don't seek after the ways of Yahweh, man. All right, because you're because you're a uh, part of the wicked as well, man. This is Psalm chapter four and verse one, Psalms ten and four. It says the wicked through the pride of his countenance will not seek after Yahweh. Yahweh is is not in all his thoughts. All right, because hey man, these people only think upon things that that's uh that make them happy, man, and make them feel good, man. I right, wish the law is gonna make you feel good and make you feel uh, uh whole, man. All right, but they don't want that, man, because it's not in them, man. It's, it, it was never it was never in them to want that, man. All right, especially these women, man. So this is Hosea chapter four and verse two it says by swearing and lying and killing and stealing and committing adultery. All right. They break out and blood touch of blood. Uh, therefore, shall the land mourn and everyone that dwelleth therein shall languish and the beasts of the field and uh, in with the fowls of heaven. Yea, the fish, the fishes of the sea also shall be taken away. All right. Because amen man is, is, is nothing but wickedness. Um, um, when you when you uh, when you look at our nation, man. All right, hey, the scripture said that there are uh, wicked men uh, 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 found among my people, r roughly paraphrasing, man. All right, because, hey, two-thirds two -thirds of our people make up majority of Israel, man. All right, and, hey, that, that spirit is out here on, on all of our women, man. All right, that evil, uh, adulterous spirit, man. All right, that wicked spirit, man, you know. And it says, yet let no man strive nor reprove another. All right, because, hey, man, hey, it, Israel is nothing but hypocrites, man. This is a very hypocritical nation, man. All right, because... Uh, uh 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 one minute all right they they they'll be like no nah, well you know you 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 should be with your man woo woo this and that then the next minute oh uh, well let let's be city girls let's let, let let it be hot girl summer all right you go outside with your ass fucking hanging out man all right hey man man hey, this this kingdom this kingdom is vexing man all right the pro hey, if you if, if you're not vexed by this kingdom man hey, you 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 just going off man if you're not vexed by this kingdom man you're with it man you know so it says, um, for thy people are as are as they that strive with the priests. All right, because hey, two because our people don't want to see righteousness, man. They don't want they don't want uh, uh to be told that, that they're going off. All right, they don't want they don't want that, man. They want they want to to be told smooth things, man. All right. So this is uh Isaiah chapter thirty and ten. It says. Isaiah chapter 38, it says, Now go write it before them in a table and note it in a book that it may be for that it may be for the time to come forever and ever. All right, things written for time are written for our learning. That this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the hear the law of Yahweh Shemal Shah. All right, man, because hey, if they if they understood the law, man, all right, they would know that uh, uh um 
um, commit adultery, man. All right, being in entanglement, dealing with another man. All right, sitting down to even have a conversation with another man, man. All right, about about your relationship, man. All right, or even uh, about anything for that matter, man. All right, you should go and deal with your husband, man. All right, hey, I'm gonna go back to this, but let me get this, man. This is uh Sirach chapter nine verse nine. It says, "Sit not at all with another man's wife." All right, you are not supposed to be dealing with another man's wife, man. All right, uh 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 uh, uh conversating with her, man. Oh, what what you doing? What you doing later on tonight, man? All right, hey, that's that's fucking going off, man. Because eventually you're gonna build, uh uh uh, you're gonna get emotions for that woman, man. All right, because you're you you are a man and that's a woman, man. All right, men and women cannot be friends, man. All right, it's not possible. Okay. And it says, nor sit down with her in thine arms. Hey, man, that, that's what was going on with uh, that Jaden, um, that Jaden uh, uh, August uh, situation, man. All right. It, it was something about him being sick or some shit, man. All right. And she went to go take care of him. All right. Which that, that, that's not, that's not her. Uh, um, um, damn, I'm trying to think of the word. Well, that, that, that's, that's not her right to do, man. You know, that, hey, he, he, he needs to go find uh, his own woman to do that, man. Not another man's woman to go and take care of him, man. All right, because, hey, you see what happened with that situation. They fell into a, uh, uh, an entanglement, all right, which is adultery, man. All right. And it says, um, and spend not thy money with her at the wine, lest thine heart incline unto her. All right, because that's a woman. You're going to eventually get emotions for her, man. All right. Hey, hey, hey man, you... you you, should, you shouldn't be around another man's woman in, 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 in any situation, man, trying to deal with her and talk to her, man, be buddy-buddy, all right? Because, hey, man, that's, that's, not, that's not your position to do, man. That's her husband's position to do, you know? And it says, uh, and, so through, and so through thy desire, thou shalt fall into destruction, all right? Because you want to be friends with this woman. All right, you want to be buddy-buddy with this woman, man. All right, you want to uh, eventually have sex with this woman. All right, therefore, Yahweh Shemal Shai is going to uh, give you over to death, man. All right, because that's what you chose, man. You chose to break the law of Sash Command, say Yahweh Shemal Shai, so you chose death, you know? So, let me get this the back of my point. This is uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 14, and verse uh, 35. It says, and if, and if they will learn anything, let them, uh, let them ask their husbands at home, for it is, for it is a shame for uh, women to speak. In the church, all right, hey man, this this is speaking of the church, but this is uh, uh overall as whole, man. All right, you are not to you are not to be sitting down with another man's woman, man. All right, trying to uh, get advice from her about your relationship. All right, trying to get uh healing from her, man. All right, any of that, man, because that's not your uh, uh that's not your right to do, man. All right, that's her husband's right, man. All right, her husband's right is to teach her. All right, uh, uh, uh have sex with her, man. All right, show her where she's fucking up at, man. All right, that's his, that's his right, because that's his woman, man. All right, not yours. If you want to go do that, get your own woman, man. All right? But let me, uh, no, I'm going to go back to this Isaiah. It's Isaiah 30. Isaiah shot at 30 in verse uh, 9. It says that this is a rebellious people, lying children, children that will not hear the law of Yahweh, which say to the seers, see not. And to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things, speak unto us smooth things, prophesy deceit. All right. And that's what our people want us to do, man. They want us to lie to them. Tell them that, oh, yeah, it's okay to be in entanglement. It's okay to uh, uh, um, uh, be wicked. All right. It's okay to smoke weed. It's okay to do all this shit, man, which is not, man. All right. And the prophets are going to continuously tell you that it's not good. All right. Until uh, until uh, um, um, we get up off these streets, man. We get up off the Internet, man. All right, you're going to, uh, hey, you people going to have to deal with us, man. All right. Whether you like it or not. And it says, get you out of the way. Turn, turn aside out of the path. Cause the Holy One of Israel to seek, uh, to cease from before us. All right, man. Ultimately, man, they hate Yahweh Shemal Shai, man. It tells you that in Luke uh, 10 and 16, man, Yahweh Shai said it himself, man. All right. Ultimately, you hate Yahweh Shemal Shai, man. You don't want, uh, um, um, you don't, you don't want to deal with the Lord at all, man. All right, because hey, the Lord is getting is getting uh, in your way, man. The Lord is uh, um, uh, the ultimate party pooper, man. All right, because you're not gonna be able to do what whatever you want, man. All right, you're gonna do what your Habashimal Shah tells you to do, or you're gonna die. All right, and it's putting hey, hey, that's simple, man. All right, so damn, so like it. Let me get this. Go back to this Hosea four and uh 
Hosea 4 and 5, it says, Therefore shalt thou, shalt thou fall in the day, and the, and the prophet also shall, fit, shall fall with thee in the night, and I will destroy thy mother. My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. Uh, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge because thou hast rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of Yahweh, I will also forget thy children. All right, amen. That's why people are, are about to get jacked up, man, on an all time scale, man. All right, because you uh, uh um, you didn't want to serve Yahweh by Shemuel Shai, man. All right, you wanted to be wicked. All right, you wanted to commit adultery. You wanted to kill each other. All right, you wanted to send each other off, man, to uh go and do. Uh, more manners of wickedness, man. All right, so hey, your Habash Shemal Shai is gonna uh, give you over to that, man. All right, the Lord is only dealing with the elect, man. All right, two thirds of our people, man. Hey, you're through, man. All right, because hey, you 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 don't want to uh, uh um, you don't want to seek out the ways of your Habash Shemal Shai, man. All right, you want to seek out your own righteousness, man. All right, which ain't no such thing as that, man. All right, the only thing that's righteous is your Habash Shemal Shai and his law, man. All right, so this is uh Proverbs chapter thirty and twenty. It says, such in the way of, of, a, of an adulterous woman, she eat it and wiped her mouth and said, I have done no wickedness. All right. And that's the spirit of a majority of these women out here, man. All right. They, they, they are going suck a rod. All right. They are going to fuck another man. All right. And they come back to you. All right. And kiss you. All right. Lay up, lay up under you, man. All right. And then when you catch them up, man, and, and find out what they really been doing, man, they're, they're, they're going to say there's nothing. They, they've been doing nothing, man. All right. They're going to make an excuse. All right. As, as to what's going on. All right, just like the whole uh, Jaden and Will Smith thing, man. All right, which is a beautiful example, man, of, of the, the relationships inside today's society, man. All right, they like to call it toxic toxic relationships, which is just exactly what it is, man. It's toxic, man. It's killing you, man. It's nothing but death, man. All right? That's, that's, all, that's all our people bring is death, man. All right, because they, cause they, uh, um, they go after the ways of this world, man. All right? So let me get this. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 14 and verse uh 24 it says they kept they kept neither uh lives nor marriage any longer undefiled, but uh either one slew another treacherously or grieved him by adultery. All right, and that's the spirit of, uh, of our people, man. All right, that's all they rap about. That's all they teach each other, okay? Is to go uh kill, kill another man, all right, and go and take his woman, all right, go and uh steal, steal another man's woman, man. That's glorified, man. All right, you hear it inside of all the rap songs, man. All right, you see it on uh, all, all the social medias, man. All right, that's all you so-called Negro, Hispanics, and Native Americans want to do, man. All right, it's be fucking niggas, man. All right, and hey, you're going to get that, man, because how about Shemal Shai is going to give you over to that, man, because hey, um, um, uh, Amos Nan, hey, you know how I ended on that, man, you know? Because hey, man, all, 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 all the wicked of our people, man, you're going to perish, man, including the women, all right? So this is uh no I grab I grab another one after this. This is Amos shot the nine of verse ten. It says all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword, which say the evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. All right, because hey man, you 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 don't believe that Yahweh Shemal Shah is gonna do what he's do what he said he's gonna do, man. All right, because of all the uh, wickedness that you have done, man. But hey, you have to pay for everything that you everything that you do, man. All right, everyone is gonna come before that judgment seat, man. All right, and hey, you people, are, hey, you have to pay, you know. Bad way of death, man. You got to pay. So, let me get this. Because, hey, man, the Lord, he, hey, the Lord doesn't care if you're a man or a woman, man. It doesn't matter. Okay? So, this is uh, Ezekiel 9 and 4. It says, uh, yep, Ezekiel 9 and 4 says, And Yahweh said unto him, Go through the go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem, and set a mark upon the forehead uh, upon the foreheads of the men that sigh and that cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. And adultery is an abomination, man. All right, and hey, the only ones that's crying crying uh, for that is the prophets, man, and the elect, man. All right, and hey, Jerusalem is a people before it's a place, man. So Yahweh Shemal Shah is going through is going through Jerusalem, man. All right, that's why so many of you so-called Negro Spans and Native Americans are dying, man. All right, because you don't want to repent, man. All right, you want to continuously uh go after your flesh. All right, so you're gonna you're gonna continuously die, man. All right, and call them like your how about Shemal Shah for that, man. All right, because you you niggas are wicked as hell, man. All right, and hey, man, when you when you perish, man, hey, we we love to see that, man. All right, because the Lord loves to see that. So this is uh Ezekiel nine and five. It says uh and and to the others he said in my hearing go ye after him. Through the city and smite. Let not your eyes spare, neither have ye pity. Okay, so hey, if you if you're not uh, um, um, 
with these lost ass commandments, man, hey, the Lord is not going to have pity upon you, man. All right. Hey, he's going to give you over to uh, your, your worst imaginations, man. Like it tells you in the book of Isaiah, man. All right. And, hey, man, hey, you're, you're, you're going to get a you're going to get a, a ass whooping like never before, man. So this is verse six. Slay utterly old and young. So, hey, man, old men, young, old man, an old woman. All right. A young man, a young woman, both maids, women and, li uh, and little children and women. <laughs> but come but come ye. Not near any man upon whom is the mark, and began at my and, and began at my sanctuary. Then they began at the ancient men which were before the house. All right, man. So hey, the Lord doesn't care if you're a man, a woman, a baby. All right, it doesn't matter, man. If you if you're doing wickedness, man. All right, and and, and you're and you're not serving your about Shemal Shah, man. You're gonna perish, man. All right. So with that, I pray that this lesson was edifying. I would like to give all praise on and glory unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Chakudash, the Anzatai, the Apostle of Great Mills, and I do it well. And salutations and blessings to you, I can as push his word with true sincerity and charity. Shalom and a Baba Ball.